Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Angelka and in today's video you will see me make the three last pieces from my art challenge inking in October. So spoiler alert, I did make the challenge 31 paintings in 31 days. So yay for me! <laughs> so day 29 was dog. And I chose to draw my deceased dog Tara, who was a Norwegian elk hound. If you have seen any other of my videos, you might have seen other drawings of her. I recently did a drawing in water soluble graphite of her. And in the first art video on my YouTube channel, I showed a couple of graphite paintings of her. So you might have seen them, you might have not. So as you can see I used my dip pen and therefore my black Indian ink. And did the fur in strokes, different strokes which I have been so much better at during this art challenge. I only have done one other animal with this technique and that was last year when I did participate in Inktober. So my skill for that has developed quite nice during October this year. And here I got some ink dripping from my pen. And when I did this painting I was so tired and um, was close to fall asleep. But I did pull through. Weird the things you do for art but I so did want to finish this challenge so I just push through. And here I did some ink washes. And I added some more black to the background. because of the mistakes I couldn't erase. So I just did try to make it look a little bit better by doing more ink splashes or drops. And here I added some details with the white gel pen. And here you can see the finished piece. And day 30 was rose. And for this one I had an idea in my head but it didn't turn out the way I planned it. So as you can see here I started with the black Indian ink and dip pen to draw the outside lines of the flower. And here for some reason I thought it would be a good idea to uh, do the uh, dark parts of the flower with pure black ink. 
and I can tell you that it, that it uh, wasn't a good idea, not at all. And here I did some washes of the black Indian ink. And here I did go over it with the red ink, red drawing ink. And once it was uh, wet, it looked quite good, but it didn't look so good when the ink had dried. And you can see on the petal that uh, I used quite a lot of black Indian ink that it doesn't look good with all that black. It was too dark. And here I try to blend uh, black Indian ink with red and it didn't turn out good either. I got quite a dark painting and here I try to do some light parts with the white Indian ink and it didn't look good with that either. But... Um, then I decided to try to paint over with the green and red ink and as you can see here it looks quite good so here is the finished piece so in the in the end it turned out quite good so that's great and day 31 was fox and for this last piece, I wanted to do something special, or at least quite good. So I did try to put down my best skills on this. And here I also chose the black Indian ink and dip pen to do the fur. And at this point I was quite tired of ink. And I do think I will not touch ink until last, uh, next year, probably. Or maybe do some ink and watercolor combined, but not pure ink as I have done here for 31 days in October. It's a little bit too much, but it was a fun challenge. And here I added some orange and I also had done some white strokes with the ink pen, no not ink pen, gel pen, uh, before I put over the orange. And I put on multiple layers but I only filmed the one first layer. So here is the result of my last piece from inking in October. And some extra bonus material if you're interested. So here is what my desk looked like for whole the October month. With the computer screen and the ink and the tripod for the camera and all the inks. And the wood board I have under my painting was 
one of this paint by number that never was finished. So it looks ugly, but the other side was perfect to use. And here is all my inks in bottles. So this was all the uh, liquid inks that I did use for this art challenge. And here we go, all the pieces, all the 31 pieces from 31 days. And I can see that I developed my skills quite nice from the first days to last days. So I hope you have enjoyed to see all of my paintings during the October month and inking in October. But now in November I will go back to more watercolor paintings, no more inks for quite a while. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you like what I do and hit the like button on this video if you liked it. And also you can see all these pieces from inking in October in picture form on my Facebook page. Because I am so much better to upload to Facebook and on Instagram. Because I barely use my phone. So there you have it, all 31 days. So this thick stack of papers is the result. So thank you so much for watching and I hope I will see you in my next video. Bye bye.